Malcolm's dream move to Barcelona has proven anything but a fairy tale so far. Having attracted some of Europe's biggest clubs with his performances at Bordeaux, he dramatically signed for the Blaugrana despite looking almost certain for an S-Roma switch. Despite the fact he would be competing with the likes of Luis Suarez, Ausmane Dembele and Rafinha, the Brazilian was feeling confident that he could make an impact at the new camp. However, Malcolm has endured such a frustrating start to life at Barcelona that October 31 marked his very first start for the club and against third-tier opposition at that. Having only made cameos against Real Velado Lid and Legains beforehand, Malcolm was finally given his opportunity by Ernesto Valverde in the Copa del Rey. It would prove to be a surprisingly tough evening for Barcelona, who didn't secure their 1-0 victory until stoppage time, when Clement Langlet finally broke the deadlock. And it's fair to say the Spanish media weren't impressed by Malcolm's performance despite him being given the perfect platform to give Valverde a selection headache. Marca branded him a ghost for his display, while ESPN awarded him a five-tenths and wrote, It can't have been easy coming in from the dark, out of rhythm, but he gave the ball away too much. It certainly won't quell rumors that Malcolm could leave Barcelona as early as January with both Tottenham and Arsenal reportedly interested. But was the reaction harsh? Was Malcolm really that disappointing? Well, there's no hiding from individual highlights and football fans have already compiled a video of the 21-year-old's supposed best bits from the game. Frankly, it doesn't bode well for his chances at Barcelona and goes to show life in Catalonia won't be a walk in the park. Take a look at the video down below, Malcolm did have his moments during the game, but he gave away the ball on far too many occasions and flattered a defence that's ranked lower than Barcelona's very own youth team. The video is punctuated by a series of terrible corner deliveries, doomed attempts to dribble past defenders, and consistently relinquishing possession in the defensive third. It's an uncharacteristic performance from a player who undoubtedly has talent, but it will certainly raise questions about his ability to perform in Spanish football. Making the transition from League One won't be easy, and the slow start made by Dembele since his 2017 move shows joining Barcelona's attacking ranks is far from simple. And of course, fans can't jump to too many conclusions after just one start, and it must be hoped that Valverde gives him another chance sooner rather than later. That being said, he'll have to improve as soon as possible or his opportunity will surely pass. Do you think Malcolm should leave Barcelona this season? Have your say in the comments section below.